join me. Join me in exuberation of life. Join us in creating excellence. Choose. 30 days, a month of fury. It was three things! You have more passion for living than you ever imagined. Be excited! Be excited! The Tappy Tibbins collection can be your three things is all I did that changed my life. Three things. Many of you know this story, but for those of you who don't and don't at home, I started six years ago. I was an overweight man living in a one-room apartment. But I had a job. I had a good job. I worked 55, 60 hours a week. That's six shifts, 13 hours a day. I worked that hard and that long for Jerry's supermarket. I fronted the milk. Do you know what that is? Fronting the milk? That's when someone reaches in and takes the milk out. I was the guy who reached in after them and fronted the milk right to the front of the rack. Someone takes their gallon of milk, you front the milk. Now, Jerry's supermarket was a wonderful place to work. Now, for a man who's 65 pounds overweight, that's a pretty good job, right? You're around food all the time. I was a man who was sick. And I was a man who needed food. I was a man who needed red meat. I was a man who needed sugar. I was a man who needed food at all times. I was depressed. I mean, I was down and out. I was a man who was 65 pounds overweight. I did this action. This was very appeasing. It very nurtured me. It nurtured my, my spiraling brain that felt I was a loser, that felt I was lost. I did this all day long. So I had a good job. I worked there all the time. But I found myself stealing meat. I found myself stealing my donuts, my bunt cakes, all that stuff. It was great. But I tell you what, I got caught. There I was, in the store, mid food and mouth. Can you imagine how low I was when he said, out the door? I left Jerry's for good. I had a little shame going on. But I'll tell you what, I still have my apartment. Until five days later, the rent came and I went, what am I going to do now? Uh -oh. Didn't have the money. I, I didn't have the money. I didn't have the, the will even to pay it. I said, the hell with it. I'll live in my car. 1979 Nissan. I lived in that car for too many days. Too many days. I want to tell you, everything I owned was in that car. Wow. Everything I owned. And I'll tell you, I was, at, I was in the depths of depression. There was no way to live. I was an obese man living with all my possessions packed, crammed into my little Nissan. I sat in this car. Five, six days going by, I didn't have the gas to drive it anymore. I didn't have the money. I'd reached my rock bottom. I had nothing. I had no reason to live. I had no, re I had no purpose in life. I had no confidence left. I had no drive. I got out of the car. I walked to the park. I saw a world ahead of me. I saw the Manhattan Island, the Big Apple. And I said to myself, <laughs> You're never going to get there. You're a fat, unhappy, pushing obese man. You're sick. I was depressed. I was down. And I considered, I considered it. I was suicidal. I, was su I, wanted to take, I wanted to end my life. And I sat on that bench. And I just let it pour out of me until a little girl walked up to me. She said, mister, please don't cry. I hadn't even realized I was crying. That little girl saved me. That little girl came up to me and said, Mr. Please don't cry. And she walked away. And in her eyes, for that brief instant, I saw everything to live for. In her eyes was all the hope and all the dreams and all the passion and everything I was missing. I was missing everything. I stopped right there. For 30 days, I changed my life so simply. And so I said, for 30 days, I'm going to eat right. I am going to pick up my spirits. And I am going to try. I am not going to give up. And I'll tell you what happened. 30 days, I lost five pounds. That's not much, granted, that is not much. But that five pounds started to make me feel a little bit better. I turned it around. I started feeling really pretty good, actually. I'd look in the mirror and I was five pounds thinner. Right? I was, I was starting to think, okay, I got a little bit more confidence.
I committed for 30 days. I had nothing. Yes. I still didn't have a job. But I found hope. And in that hope, I found a way to make it. So six years later now, I started getting into health foods. You all know I'm into health foods. I'm all over the place in health food. And I'll tell you what, health food has changed my life. The first supermarket I bought was Jerry's. Right there in Jersey City. I swear to God. When I turned my life around those six years ago, I realized one thing. There's no turning back. Please don't turn back. No. Please be committed. Please keep that passion for life growing. Because I'm living proof that it works. I want to give you the promise that little girl gave me. The Tappy Tippins Collection can be your... is all it takes. 30 days of revolution has your life. I'm here to share with you that it can happen. In five short years, I turned it all around. It was commitment. It was passion. Three things you can do to change your life. If you know how my life started out. I was an overweight man living in a one-room apartment. I'd reached my rock bottom. I turned it around. I am a living testament. 65 pounds thinner. I feel great. Yeah. is all I did to change my life. Three things. Month of fury! 30 days! No red meat! No refined sugar! That's two things that we talked about. Number three. Oh, number three. This drives most people crazy. You're not gonna like it. This is easy so far. If you can give this up for 30 days, it will. I guarantee you, change your life. You will be a new person. Are you ready? Are you ready? No orgasm. No! no. Orgasm! Oh. Oh. Commit with me. Have that commitment. Have that passion. 30 days. No, no orgasm. No orgasm. Don't do it. I guarantee you, every one of you has been on this drug of orgasm since you become sexual. <laughs> Nothing wrong with it. It's, it's, it's difficult to stop. I'm not saying it's a bad thing to come. I'm not saying that at all. It's a great <laughs> thing to come, right? Am I right? Yeah. It's a great thing. Have you ever told your body no? Have you ever had it listen? I want commitment! Yeah. I want passion! passion. Yeah. Yes! No orgasm for 30 days. You need to be committed. You need to be passionate. For 30 days, 30 days, month of fury! I swear it will change your life. You know the number. Give us a call. Juice it up. Juice by you. Juice by you. Juice by you. Juice by you. Juice by you.